Hey, this is Robert here at Guzzi Fabrication. We just got our package in from wellmonger.com. It's going to be a Furic gas lens with the O ring. These are in 332nd or 2.4. And some 2% lanthanated tungsten. And here it is the Furic Jazzy 10 cups, see through cups. And an extra diffuser comes with it plus the o-rings and pulling it out of the package we can take a look now this is a CK worldwide uh, torch number 17 it is a flex but it's set up like a standard torch with the standard collet and back cap and cup so we're going to start tearing this thing down. And we'll do a little comparison. Now that's the Furic Wedge type collet. A lot shorter and I really like that a lot more than the standard type pilot you see the splits there that thing will twist in there if you uh, get too rough or it overheats the wedge completely eliminates all those issues last a really long time all right get the cup off nothing wrong with the standard stuff at all but here we are comparing the cup with the uh, Furic Jazzy 10. And removing the collar body. And a side by side of the Furic gas lens. Compared to the standard collet body. And then I also have a CK Worldwide gas lens. And I'm going to set those side by side. And you can see the difference with the uh, O ring landing groove. Whereas the CK Worldwide on the left doesn't have that. and the stock insulator and you can see it's mated specifically for that type of stock cup and it won't work with the jazzy 10 or other thread on uh, stubby gas or stubby uh, cups shot of both of the insulators side by side just changing the insulator shorten up the uh, whole assembly itself and the o-ring that it is supplied and the instructions make a life a lot easier if you do that we snap the new insulator into place Thread in the new uh, gas lens. And I was just like to hand tighten those. Still the call. And the tungsten. And this is just a back cap that I had, a short back cap in the TIG box. And now we're going to uh, slide this O-ring into place. Get it on that little landing there. Make sure it's seated properly and located properly. 
and moisten. And here we go. There it is seated in place. And now here's a shot of the finished assembly. And one of the reasons you're going to find using a cup like this, the wider the cup, the longer your stick out can be. Stick out of the tungsten is what I'm referring to. And the rule of thumb is the width of the cup, that's your stick out. Or that's your maximum stick out. Hey, if you like this video, hit that like button. Subscribe to our channel and check out our other videos. As always, thanks for watching.